Jonathan with Project Positivity and the Positive Pin, and I've been waiting for this interview for a while. I had to track down Jacqueline Middlesat from um, a busy schedule she has. I met Jacqueline at an event that we did for Maison. It was kind of a networking and small business organization, uh, kind of helping everybody boost everybody's uh, local businesses, and that was great. And Jacqueline was there interviewing people because Jacqueline does some work with a, a really cool organization called S18 Scene. And I knew the minute that I met her and her wonderful mom, Kim, that they had kind of a different positive energy about them. And after she interviewed me for the Positive Pin, which will be out on video soon, um, I, I knew that I wanted to get her on tape. So Jacqueline, I want to present you with the Positive Pin for your wonderful attitude. I know she, she's yes, already I... wearing the pink one. <laughs> I meant to ask her to take that off before we filmed it, but it doesn't matter because you can't have too many Positive Pins. Awesome. So please Thank you. accept that. and. I'd like for you to tell our fans some of the things that you do because you really have a great attitude and I'm sure you get that from your mom, but tell our fans, <laughs> um, how, do you, how do you keep a positive attitude you know, in your daily routine? I don't know. I think of positivity as an aura that you can give off and it's a personal um, aspect to your personality. So I think that you can't really change, I don't know, you can't let people change your positivity. So it's kind of like something you give off. Mm -hmm. So I think as in if I try to stay positive and think of all the good things that I could also help people in the process of helping myself yeah. with my attitude. So, everything. you know, one thing I noticed, everybody, we're all susceptible to influences of, of negativity. So when someone cuts you off or, 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 you know, you're having a bad day, what do you do to just say, you know what, I'm not going to let that affect me? Do you have something that you do that mm, helps what, you get out of it? I don't know. Whenever I'm having a bad day, I make sure to talk to my family. Yeah. And because um, I can't keep anything from my family, I'm like, I'm an open book. But um, I make sure that I have my own support group also as my family who is also always there for me. Mm -hmm. So you guys always have to talk to your family. Always just talk to your family. That's big, yeah, it relying on your family. It so yeah. much, I, helps so much. And your mom gave you some good principles about being positive. She said yes. something earlier today about when you woke up in the morning, um, mm -hmm. what was it? It's um, have a great day or not, the choice is yours. Yeah, and that's really good. Cool. And that was one of our uh, things for my elementary school. Whenever we'd have announcements, the teachers would be like, have a great day. You know, we didn't understand it at that age. We're like, don't tell us what to do. But, <laughs> but now <laughs> we kind of understand. We're like, you know, it's your choice to have a great day and nobody else's. They, you don't own their negativity. You or yourself. Yeah, you know, some, and I think that so much of people's attitude, it, it starts in the home with good parenting. An interview I did uh, several weeks ago was with a girl named Mara, and she told us about some of the principles that her, her family grew up with, and I was like, wow, that's really great. Not to say I wasn't raised with, with thinking positive thoughts, but in the home, it's so important for the family's parents to, to instill in their kids a great and um, positive attitude. So let's talk about SA Teen Scene real quick. SA Teen Scene is what? Um, SA Teen Scene, it's a show created by teens, starring teens, and actually all about teens. So it's like a new show about exciting, fun stuff. You know when you're like flipping through the channels on the TV and you're like, oh, yay, news. But we're trying to figure out where teens can also get into what's going on in society without being bored, per se. Yeah. Like, you know, waiting for the commercials. But <laughs> where can they find that? Um, we can, you can actually find that on YouTube right now. Um, S18 Scene is our name. And um, we're also on Instagram if you want to follow us there. And Facebook, S18 Scene. Um, also, Good Job Texas Junior. Dot com is also where you can find um, a lot of our episodes. Is there a is it sat scene dot com or anything like that? Do you um, have a domain? We don't name? have a domain. Not yet. Mm -hmm. Coming. Okay. Yes. And then your mom said, yeah, your mom said you're doing something about anti-bullying, which is huge right now in the news. Anti-bullying. Mm -hmm. So explain to our, our fans what what is the the color wheel or. The... Um, this is Prismatic Lip Sparkles. Actually, it's a fundraiser where the proceeds go to different um, nonprofits of anti-bullying causes. So. Right now, we were thinking of the prismatic, um, your or the aura you give off, mm -hmm. and how um, it's all colorful and bright in your own personality. Mm -hmm. So we were thinking, you can't really choose a color for personality. So that's where you get the color wheel from, where it's just like a big, um, a big creation of your attitude. And where can they find these? Everything you can find these at camimpressions.com um, on our website. And there's a link towards it, and um, we'll definitely be having more information up soon. This was definitely um, a spur of the moment type thing yeah. where you know I've been bullied, and I was thinking just having um, a cause that people could easily get to. And this is like flavored lipstick. Yes, mom's everything's saying. flavored. Um, they may look super neon, but they're actually very sheer. I'm wearing the blue one right now, actually. So. Um, they all have their own certain flavors, like as you can tell, this one's actually pineapple, I believe, or mm. coconut. 
Um, this one's green apple. You have uh, blueberry, grape, strawberry, uh, cherry, just a bunch of different, just random flavors. <laughs> That's really awesome. So tell, tell our fans before we wrap up, uh, what are some of your goals? Um, I really want to be a speaker. Um, like a an inspirational speaker for anti-bullying, awesome. really badly. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah. You're not afraid. You're not. You're not shy. So that's really great. That's a great start. Yeah. Uh, have you considered going to Toastmasters? Uh, I... Do you know what it is? Mm -hmm. Toastmasters. Okay. It's an <laughs> it's an organization of people that that learn how to become better speakers. So oh, you should check it out. It's I, very will, cool. I will definitely check that out. Thank you. <laughs> no. Well, guys, thank you for joining us again. And thank Jacqueline, you. thank you for doing this. Thank you for having me. Oh, absolutely, <laughs> guys. If you're interested in a positive pin. Go to the website, it's www.positivepin.com. And if you're interested in seeing more inspirational, positive videos like Jacqueline's, go to our blog, it's www.thinkpositiveblog.com. And we will see you in our next installment.